Hi everyone. Yesterday, the user DB Pepper asked me if I can make this video tutorial for the Mo Chuck Brush HDT in English. Okay, today we are trying to make this mission possible. <laughs> this is my first video tutorial in English. So the first things we need to do is go to this side, Nexus mod. If you don't have an account, you need one. And check the the mod page for the Shark Breast, Shark Breast HDT mod. This is just for Skyrim Legacy Edition. Check the requirement. The mod needs two requirements, HTT physic extension and XP32 maximum skeleton extended, XP XPMSE. You need to download both files and install it first. And then you can go back to the Shark Breast HDT mod and download it. Okay, once you download the mod, click on it, right click, and extract the mod. Inside the folder, you will see different options for your Shark Breath HDD effect. We are using Collision option. If you want, you can try everything you want from all these this folders and all these folders too. We are using for the purpose of the video uh, collision option, low potting. You have right here a data folder. This is basically the mod. You need to compress all these files or folders and install it with your mod manager. But first you get this folder SKSC plugins with this file. This is the effect. Basically the, the, the effect you need to to change for the different option you see in your in your mod. Go back and select an option. We are using collision option low potting. Right click copy the file you want go back to your data folder open SKSC plugins paste and overwrite now you have the collision option low potting file in your mode now you need to compress all this file and install it using your mod manager or if you want to, to install the mod manually just copy drag and drop to your data folder this is your data folder for your Skyrim game you need just to select all drag and drop if you want to, to install it manually or compress all this file in a WinRAR or WinZip file and install it via your mod manager. I want to copy this title here and then open this data folder, select all, right click, add to archive or archive, control V, then write the extension, press OK select drag and drop to your windows mod manager i have the mod already installed okay when the mod is installed remember to run a loot it is important for the low order now we are going to open the game 
and in the next few steps we need to find the HTT Havoc object file and load it into our character. Let's open the game. Okay, now we need to find the HTT Havoc object. The easy way to do that is to use a mod called as at item menu, Legacy Edition. I put the link in the video description so you can download it and install it. This mod use the letter C as a default key to open this window. Now you can locate the mod you are looking for. We are looking for, for the HDT Havoc object mod. Okay. Uh, let's see. Okay, this is it. HTT Havoc object dot ESP. Click on it and then click the file. This move the file to your inventory. Press Q. And now you can find the the HTT object file in your inventory. Okay, now we are using the a sneak key, it's control, control key to see the actually the breast effect that we have without the HTT Havoc ESP file loaded. Okay. This is the actual breast effect. Now, when we load the HDT Havoc object, you notice uh, a little movement in the breast, and now we can have a different effect. This is collision option, low porting, remember that. Okay, let's open the inventory again and remove the file, HTT Havoc object, and then you can see this little movement in the breast area. Now we don't have a collision option. Okay, let's try it again. And now we have the collision option and the low porting. This is what the, the effect we choose with collision option. Okay, this is the way. This is the tutorial. It's very simple. It's not uh, complicated stuff. Remember to install the requirement, the skeleton and the HDT physics extension and you need to the add item menu le mod to locate the file i put the the link in the video description so you can download it if you have uh, any doubt any question about how to do that please in the comment section this is my first video in english uh, i hope uh, you can understand and uh, everything I do here. So let me know. Maybe maybe I try another one. Of there of my another video that I made in the past, uh, another tutorial. Maybe I try to to convert to an English version. So this is it. Let me know in the comment what you think. See you in the next one. Bye.